and then eventually we'll get the platinum. I don't, I don't really care about the platinum, but I might as well have it. If I have every Souls slash Talton Sanctuary Lords of the Fallen platinum ever, I might as well have another one. And yeah, I'll be busy next week with Jerry shit. Um, looks like Lucius is probably the the Jerry replays we're gonna be focusing on mainly, since he's actually played the character a lot already because of that PC hack. Hmm. And I might play Syndicate today. It just depends how busy I am with family shit. Okay, so this. Is Elevator is down, that means we can just go up here, and this will be relatively close to the end of the archives. Uh, I'm not sure if I fought the three dudes yet, I don't think so. Those guys are a little bit scary. So it's something to be wary of. Well, kill this thing. This is gonna be annoying shit, right? Yeah. And I don't remember what that item is. I think it's not. It might just be like a tight knife scale. We don't really have that much danger if I went over there, but I'm still gonna be lazy. Alright. We are gonna have to fight gargoyles, or I might just run past the gargoyles. Either way. So I think we'll be fine if we weren't fighting them. Uh, it doesn't seem like I'm going to be super philosophical this time as I was in the last Bloodborne stream. So that means I'll probably play pretty well. So let's see this. Syndicate is really fun. Um, it's just fun killing people. <laughs> the combat is a little bit better than it used to be. And it's good enough to make the game pretty fun. So, I'm gonna be playing the show today, and I did buy the season pass because it was like the game plus the season pass was like 70% off or something. It's a pretty good deal. I usually don't buy DLC unless I know it's gonna be good. But uh, I'm pretty sure Jack the Ripper is supposed to be okay, and that'll just be more time to play Syndicate. I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing after Syndicate explicitly. Also, I didn't really do anything for PS Plus this month other than some fairy streams. But uh, I don't really enjoy that game very much, so... Focusing on Street Fighter stuff has been more enjoyable for me. I did want to play Paragon, but the problem is getting enough disk space to play it. Since we're playing Syndicate now. Uh, so I may or may not play it, I haven't decided. We'll see. And what the other one, Saints Row, I can pretty much play that whenever I feel like it. Which I probably will eventually. I do like Saints Row in general. It seems to be a decent game. Um, I watched the speedrun of it. That was pretty entertaining. And I was just like a, like a 70 year old kid or something. And I think his dad was there, or was on the phone with him at some point. But he handled himself pretty well, so good on that kid, whoever he was. That was last year, last Awesome Games doing quick, so December, January, whatever. And I've been watching a lot of speedruns. Uh, Super Great Friends uh, Zero Time Dilemma finally got started. His coverage of it. I did play that game, and I do intend to do YouTube shit with it, but uh, I have to upgrade PCs before I can do that. I did try to do it with uh, a laptop, but it didn't work, so <laughs> I just wound up playing it. It doesn't even work on my main computer, uh, despite having really terrible graphics, but it is a really, really good game, so if you're, if you're curious about that, had an interest in 999 or VLR, Zero Time Dilemma, quite good. Uh, we seem to be racking up a lot of souls for my trophy. Uh, 
have used one Estus. <laughs> well, now two, but... I haven't really been taking that much damage to this point. We do have to fight three champs now. And then make our way across the bridge and what have you. There's another wax pool right here, but we're already past all the shit where it would matter. And yeah, it's pretty much just the jumps. Uh, the charged R2 really decimates human enemies. You can individually aggro these guys, even walking. Oh, patch downloaded. Oh man. We're not going to see that today, but I guess it wasn't a very big patch. There we go. Like so. Even something scary like a great axe doesn't matter. Oh, nice. <laughs> Kind of had to guess where that door was, but apparently we got it. And he should be gone. What? Get that shit out of here. Oh, I still got crystal whatever lady to deal with. And bow guy. The black hat. How dare you arrow me? You said you could arrow me. Okay, looks like we're good. Doesn't seem like Crystal Magic Lady can really do that much damage. Yeah, maybe. And we're just gonna go refill our blood vials before I fight Twin Princes, so I don't really have to worry about anything. What the fuck was that? Parrying me. Evil bitch. I don't recall ever having any trouble with this enemy. We could always switch to firebombs. <laughs> firebombs always work, so... There's no better way to deal with every enemy in the game but firebombs. Like... Can't handle this bitch. Firebombs. Apparently she heals. Oh no. Okay. I'm probably gonna use that weapon at some point, the Onokiri, Ubadachi, Katana, and Wakazashi combo, I imagine. Soul of a great champion. Don't know if that's the the ultimate soul, but probably is. Soul of great hero equivalent. There's the other shortcut. Probably not a meaningful shortcut at this point, but who knows? Uh, we could go up there and do some shit, but no real reason to. Let's just get on our Demon Souls uh, 1 3, I believe it is. Rampart. A little bit higher in the sky this time. That's about it. Of course, the 1 1 Rampart looks pretty similar to this too, but it's much narrower. Doesn't have 30 enemies. Oh, max distance. It's beautiful. Uh, my last Bloodborne stream, I think like the first hour and a half I had no viewers, and then at the end I had like uh, a dozen or so. so. Which is pretty good for you too. So no need to front. We don't get any viewers for the first while here. Unless the stream is, is only an hour, as I already surprised. If I had to guess, assuming I kill everything, it'll probably take like two and a half hours. Probably about ten attempts on Nameless Game. And uh, half a dozen on Twin Princes, maybe on Lord of Cinder as well. I don't think Lord of Cinder is that difficult, but who knows. Um, I don't think we have to summon anything. Oh, we can summon for Twin Princes. If I really don't feel the fight, then we can go buy a bunch of spells. Uh, that guy lived with, like, almost no health left, unfortunately. 
and stole our vast compository of souls. I'm pretty sure our level up is still like 130k souls, so we're still going to be getting levels with some rapidity. So less than one tenth of the Bloodborne level up equivalent <laughs> at this point. This should be down already, yeah. and then we can use an ember while we run it up. Should go without saying that that enemy that killed me is probably the hardest enemy in the game that isn't bullshit. Assuming it was the two-handed sword one. I guess it was the one-handed sword one, it's not that bad. Like the the big giant dragon axe ja jackasses, assholes. Those guys are harder, but they're lame as fuck, so who cares if they're harder? They don't care. Ah. So that was a counter hit. And I think that was just a regular... Maybe it was a direct hit, who knows. If you hit with a certain part of the blade, it will do more damage. That's how every weapon works. Or almost every weapon works in the Souls series. All the way back to Demon Souls, actually. With the sword, it doesn't make that much sense because it tends to be around the tip. And the the most lethal part to be hit with a, a double-edged sword would be like probably like 20% or 30% of the way up the hilt, something like that. That's where the most force would be exerted. The tip is just for prodding. Okay, this guy is not as scary as I was making him out to be. Oop, I did not get rid of his stamina. I thought he was gonna do a weapon skill, but he just poked me. Little jerk. Nah. He might still be scary. <laughs> the two end sword one is gonna hit pretty damn hard, I imagine. Though. Probably not as hard as they used to hit, or as they hit in the game, relative to your earlier game stats. I was considering kicking this guy, but he seems to be more aggressive than expected. I let go of the charge there, but it's still retained on me. Which is nice. Slowly making our way up to uh, twin jackasses. <laughs> How many times can I say jackass today? Twin bastards, twin assholes, twin not very good design, or not very well designed. Come on, shield jackass. <laughs> that was not intentional, but I guess at some point it will be. Uh, we're still like 20 some videos behind on Dark Souls 3 videos, as far as editing them out of the streams. But that's okay. Bloodborne, I'm not far behind at all. Like 10 maybe. And I do more than one Bloodborne video a day usually. With the exception of yesterday, that was just the Nightmare Frontier video, wherein I talked about like seven different philosophical topics at once. <laughs> and died over and over. Uh, but as I said, if I'm good at talking, then I'm bad at playing, and vice versa. Uh, today I've been playing okay. I think my talking is getting a little bit better over time, so maybe I'll start sucking. Gameplay-wise, who knows? There should be sword guy. Okay. You really don't want to fuck with this guy too hard, or he'll completely annihilate him. He's using my weapon, as it were. Anime so difficult and inspired the whole damn run. <laughs> also, just a nice looking sword, and I don't use great swords often enough, so. A good uh, correction for my standard weapon choices.
Alright, we'll try to fight him once, and then I'll judge from that whether I want to go do the... the side quest to, uh, get all the stuff. All stuff that just died. Um... I don't know what. I would assume one of the Golden Wing Knights, but who knows.